Hey everyone, it's John here from Matsuyaki, back with another video. I have to do a quick retake because there was like a weird sound in the background. Hopefully this one's better. But the Toronto Maple Leafs putting Wayne Simmons, Adam Gaudet, Kyle Clifford, and Victor Mete on waivers. They officially signed Zach Aston Reese to a one-year $850,000 contract. A lot of other waivers news and NHL news out there. The Toronto Maple Leafs are also looking like they're going to keep Nick Robertson and Dennis Malkin. So some LTIR stuff, some manipulation there. And obviously, like, the Jordy Ben injury and the Dahlstrom injury, like, they're figuring things out. And to me, it's always, like, interesting to try to track what they're doing there. But obviously, Tavares will come back in a couple weeks, hopefully. And with a healthy lineup, I'd love to see Robertson on a line with Tavares and Elander slide Kerfoot down to the third line with Yarn Crow and Engvall, and then have Camp, Aston Reese, and Aubrey Kubel as a shutdown line with Malgan as the guy that will be input in the lineup when needed through whatever injuries or a night off back-to-backs all that stuff i think malgan needs to play at least half the season robertson get his chance as well and then the defense doesn't change i mean i wouldn't mind a justin hall trade but we'll see what happens uh, other waivers news uh connor ingram on waivers could be an interesting pickup that performance he put up against colorado hepo niemi with florida mahura with anaheim defenseman uh, Yuso Valamaki did get claimed from the Calgary Flames. Uh, he got claimed by the Arizona Coyotes from the Calgary Flames. So Arizona claiming another younger, intriguing guy that maybe will get a chance to play decent minutes. Valamaki, former first-round pick, so didn't work out in Calgary. Arizona giving him a shot. Also guys like Mike Riley and Nick Foligno on waivers. So a lot of storylines, guys. If you haven't seen them yet, just check it out on Twitter or online. Chris Johnson and Frank Cervelli among the names setting it out there. All the waiver names. So rosters are getting set for this upcoming week. The season is underway, guys. So I hope you check out the live streams, all the videos. Hit that subscribe button, the like, the notification bell, all that good stuff. Let me know what kind of videos you want to see on this channel, what kind of streams. I am really excited Nick Roberts is going to get his opportunity. I think it's uh, it's time for the guy to show it in the season, show it in the big club. And I think that top six of the Leafs, when healthy, will be really dominant. I think the domination from the top six, the depth can carry the defense can be above average like they've been. It just comes down to the goaltending. If Matt Murray can stay healthy, I'm still putting my eggs in that basket in terms of playing at least 45, 50 games. I think he can do it. I think they'll probably split the starts for the most part, but I think Matt Murray can do it. Any other storylines around the league, let me know what you guys think. Um, I think that there's a couple interesting, like with Buffalo and their younger players coming in. Arizona, I feel like they'll still claim another couple guys or make moves. Montreal, they've got to figure out that log jam because they have so many guys on that roster and that forward group especially. Outside of that, we'll just keep going through the storylines, keep talking about it as the news comes through. And I just wanted to quickly make the video because the updates came while I was making a stop and then that's how it always goes. So subscribe, like, comment, notification, bell, all that good stuff. It's free. Appreciate you guys. We'll chat soon.